Okay, Hot Rod folks out there, I got something I want to talk to y'all about. Some of y'all been around a long time. You remember when uh, Hell Ride 66 passed away. Um, he was an awesome dude. We made a lot of videos. We talked a lot about him, and, and he died. And his family didn't have enough money to bury him. And they, uh, and we, we got, we started, we, us, the YouTube community, started the GoFundMe page, and we raised money to bury him. Jason, his name was Jason, too. Well, time passed. I met another Jason a while back who was building a Hot Rod Model A pickup truck, and I did a video with him, which I'll put a link on here too, um, of him in a wheelchair with the use of one arm, I think it's his left arm, still determined to build that truck. It's like a 350, three two barrel carburetor, and he built a frame, he's done everything. The guy's got some smarts, let me tell you. This winter, we live in Maine. I'm in Georgia right now, but they live up in Maine where I live uh, in, the, in the summer. And uh, you know, in Maine, winter's not a joke. People freeze to death in Maine without heat. His wife sold a boat they had and took the money and paid a down payment to a local company there in Union, Castle Builders, for heating pellets to get them through the winter. And they closed their doors, left town, and stiffed everybody in town with the money they had paid for heating pellets and various other projects. This leaves them without enough money to heat their home this winter. So I went on tonight, and I started the GoFundMe page, and I'm going to put the link in here. And if you're willing to, and if you've got the funds, I don't want anybody to, you know, do anything sacrificial, but if you've got the funds and you're willing to help out somebody who is a very determined hot rod builder, and let me tell you, if you're in a wheelchair and can't walk and you only got the use of like one arm and stuff like that and yet you're still determined to build a hot rod. I would call that being a very determined hot rod builder. Now this is a guy that needs heat. It's just simple as that. We're not, we're talking, you know, it's a serious need. They need to stay warm this winter. Um, and it wasn't their fault. They, they had the money, they had the plans and somebody stole, basically somebody stole their, their heat money. I'm asking my YouTube friends to help me raise $660. I wish we could raise a whole lot more, and maybe we can. I don't know if you can give more money than that or not, but uh, you know, I just like to do everything I can to help these folks out because they're good people. His wife Holly's a sweetheart. I just love them to pieces. You know, they just overcome all kind of obstacles, and uh, I think we hot rod folk out here in the YouTube world and Facebook world, wherever you're at, we can do this. Just you know, between all of us, think that much, ain't that much money. Um, heck, I'd just do it myself, but I just had to pay for my brother's burial expenses, funeral and all that myself, and kind of put me in a bind for right now. But uh, I was thinking, well, there's other, there's other tubers out there, and they'll help. So I'm going to put the GoFundMe page link thing right in here somewhere. I'll put it somewhere. And then uh, if y'all are willing and you got the heart to do so, and if the good Lord you know, lays it on your heart and he's blessed you in such a way where you think this is something you can do, then I'd appreciate it. And I'm sure they would if you'd join me and let's help keep Jason warm this winter. Okay? Okay. So, there you go. Love y'all. Uh, we're going to church tomorrow. We can't hardly wait. We're so excited. See ya.